This is the third optical competition that we've run at the RCA and it's open to the whole of the School of Material. There's a great um, interesting link here between the creativity of the RCA and the optical industry side of 100% Optical. In this particular competition there are one or two conventional designs which I quite like because they were groundbreaking in their own way. But there are also some that were completely off the wall, which I thought were really fantastic and really trying to expand the boundaries of spectacle design. Well, they're, they're very out there compared to what I was used to doing for the NHS and stuff like that. I think it's very high quality and I think some of the flat work is really, really impressive as well. Some of them actually made the models that look like fully formed things already. I really love the, the thought that the process that goes into it deconstruction right back to the very basic materials, working on materials that can be used. The previous years, the winners of the competition have actually ended up making them as part of their final collection as well. Well, my name's Hannah Evans, and um, I do fashion women's wear knitwear, and I entered the 100% optical competition last year. It was really good, it was a really good experience, and I wanted to do it because I'd never done anything to do with eyewear before. The thing that I've noticed most with eyewear design is that you've got such little space to play with all the different details, and when you're working with fashion, you're often working with big shapes and things that sort of cover the whole body, uh, but with eyewear, it's, you really have to kind of zoom in. It's a great pleasure for me to see the, the work that can be done in, in such a a small object and yet there's so much creativity that can go into it. The optical industry, uh, particularly in England, is kind of limited. So we're very fortunate to have an organisation like the RCA trying to get people, young people, interested in new, new groundbreaking design. We've got to get them making frames and we've got to make them designing frames and we've got to have, find people to buy them and wear them and it's making people feel creative about eyewear. That helps the whole eyewear industry get that message across that people should be as creative with their eyewear as they are with their shoes, with their clothing, uh, every aspect of their wardrobe. The final six that we've come up with are really, there's maybe one semi-conventional type design, but the others were, I thought, quite groundbreaking in their own way, and pleasure to see them. Uh, well, we selected six overall winners um, they have to kind of finesse their product, if you like, for the exhibition. The candidates will all be exhibited at 100% Optical. It gives you an opportunity to talk to and introduce yourself to people that are really influential and just excited about the industry. It was really great um, at 100% Optical and actually at, on the stand and at the event and I think it was organised really well and it, it looked really great. Um, and a lot of people came through and sort of talked to us. Um, so yeah, it was great to sort of get a glimpse into that industry.